hello everyone so welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to teach you how to use the obs on your live stream okay because there's a lot of people was asking me asking how to uh, use the obs on your live stream so this is also good, especially like my face is very big. <laughs> so we're going to have a full screen, so I don't want that. So I want to use the uh, uh, the OBS so I can minimize my camera. And you can put a lots of things too, whatever you want to, uh, video, photos, uh, slideshows, whatever you want. You can do that too there. So let's go to my computer. Uh, I'm here in my computer. So first thing we do is download the app. Okay. So this can be done with any kind of uh, laptop except the Apple. Okay. Apple. But we have a, another tutorial for that. So I will just put it in the link below for, for those who are using Apple. Okay. Apple brands of laptop ayan, or MacBook or something like that. Ayan. So the next is, of course, you need to log in to your Microsoft uh, of store. And the next, uh, the one that I'm using is Ultra Screen Recorder for free. So this is what I am using. Okay. So this is what I am using. So I have uh, uploaded this one already. So you can see it's just read and launch. But uh, for if you did not uh, have this one yet, so it will be a get, it was written here, is get, okay? So it will be written here, get. So then you can upload it to your PC, okay? So then the next step is I'm going to show you, okay? So when you upload it, okay, just wait it and then uh, just uh, follow the instruction and next 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 it's just like that until you have it okay okay so the next so after you download the uh, screen ultra screen recorder or another term is OBS so this would it look like okay so this is how it looks like but here I have my scenes already because I am using it already so uh, it's just the same procedure okay so first is you're going to add a scene here, okay? So add a scene, okay? So next is okay. Okay, it's just the same procedure, okay? So you have a black screen now, okay? And then next is if you want to add something, okay? So then you're going to click this one, the source here in the sources, okay? So then next is you're going to click that one. Okay, so if you want to add text, then you can click this one, text, okay? Okay, so you can type anything what do you want. Okay, welcome to my live stream. Okay, welcome to my live stream. Okay, and then you can choose uh, the fonts here. So, whatever you want to be the font is. So, I just choose this one. Okay, and you can choose also the things here. So, you can just look for that one. Okay, whatever you want to. And then here you can see if you want it in uppercase or none or lower. None is just like how it, you have written it, okay? Okay, so then uh, if you want it in vertical or whatever. And then here, what's the color of the text? Then you can choose whatever you want here, okay? Okay, so I just prefer the white one. Better, yeah, something like that. Then you can choose the color if you want. Okay, so how about the background? What's the color of the background? Okay, let's just try this one, okay? So, okay, so how about that one? Okay, so then the alignment on the rest of the things, you can just check that one, okay? So this one is just too small, you can adjust it if you want. So if you want it more bigger or smaller or whatever you want, okay? So let's just say that one. So we have added uh, the text already, okay? So let's just say, uh, you want to add a photo, okay? So here you can do image, okay? And then okay, and then browse, and then choose the images that you want to be to be uploaded here, okay? So let's just say this one, okay? So I want this one to be uploaded. 
okay so then okay so this is it okay so you can adjust this one again so you can adjust what sizes would you like it to be okay let's just say this one okay so let's just say like that okay and then next is how to add um, your camera okay so the next you're going to do is still all you're going to do is just click the add okay add and then video capture okay so then video capture and then here you go okay so we can change the camera okay so that's my camera now so i'm using my phone for recording this one okay so that's my camera then you can adjust that one so whatever you want it to be if you want it more bigger or smaller it doesn't matter it's up to you okay so it's up to you if you want it more bigger or smaller so i prefer a little bit more smaller something like that it will be better for me okay so let's just say it's like that okay and then next you're going to do is uh if you want to add more things like here so you can just uh look for it here you can add the slideshows okay so slideshows you can just add it's the same procedure it's all the same procedure okay so you can do a lots of things what do you want here to have or you can add also a background let's just say this one you want this one to be a background so you can make it a little bit bigger like that okay so here it goes okay so you can see like this like that or you just adjust my my camera or you can just say like this this looks good too yes something like that you can do also like that this looks good too yeah i think so okay so you, you of course you need to upload the uh, first the the photos or the things that you want to put here on your pc okay so you should uh so I don't want to to be seen, okay? So I don't want myself to be seen. So then, uh, okay, so it's just like that. So it's, that's very easy, okay? So the next step is you're going to connect it to your YouTube. So we're done here. So next step is open your browser, of course, and then go to YouTube. And then next you're going to do is open your channel. And then next is go to your YouTube studio, okay? okay so next is going to your youtube studio and then next you're going to click this one okay go live okay go live okay and then when you come here you should click stream okay this one stream okay you're going to click stream but it looks like this for me because i have used this uh, setting many times so i have some suggestions but uh but for for the first timers okay when you click the stream it will show up directly like this okay and then you're going to write down the title of course the title of your live stream let's just say first first live stream okay so here we go and then of course you're going to make it as a public of course and then next one is uh what's the description of your live stream so you can write down please like and subscribe or whatsoever what's the the description of your live stream okay so you can write down whatever you want to so but for me let's just say this one please like and subscribe and subscribe okay let's just say like that okay or what's the description it's up to you what do you want to be written there okay so if you want it to be scheduled like you've done it today and then you want your live stream for tomorrow then you can turn it this one on okay so then you can choose the date and the time okay so let's just say uh you want to do it today okay let's just say you want to do it today okay so there are some uh, times here that you can choose okay so what's the time you want it to be done okay so let's just say i want it to be done in this time okay so 10 10 okay and then uh you can upload also a thumbnail for this one okay so let's just say i upload this one okay so i have my time th thumbnail now okay so then you're going to click create stream okay 
create stream okay so this is how it looks like now first, uh, the next step is you're going to copy the stream key okay so you're going to copy the stream key okay so after you copy the stream key so you go back to your obs or ultra screen recorder okay and then you will click this one file okay so after you click the file and then you're going to see the setting okay so you click first the file and then next you're going to see the setting okay and then when you click the setting you're going to see this this one okay and the next step is you're going to click the stream okay and then next is you're going to look youtube okay so here and then next is you're going to paste the uh, the key here that we have copied already okay okay so here it is now and then you're going to click apply and then okay so you're good to go now you can do it now if you want okay so let's just say let's do it now okay so we want to start it now so i'll just show you how it looks like okay and then next is you're going to click the start streaming okay start streaming okay so this one okay so you're going to click that one and then after that you're going to see it in here so let's just wait for that okay so this is how it looks like now okay so uh, what it looks like in here will show up in there okay so it's like example can you see when you move things here it will show up here too on your live stream too okay so let's like, say like example i want to move this one it will move also right there so don't do anything here as much as possible okay so it will move also in there okay so when you click this go live then you will be live to everyone and how your obs looks like that's how it will looks like in there okay on them or the people that they are watching on you okay okay so it will be like that okay so let's just say you don't want yourself to be heard okay so let's just say you don't want yourself to be heard so you can see the settings here okay you can see the settings here you can close that one okay so when you close that one your mic is closed okay so your mic is closed so they can't hear you so they can't hear you okay you cannot do it in here you can see you cannot do it in here when you do that one and then you think that you have been mute no it's not so you should do it in here okay so if you are mute in here but you are not mute in here then they can still hear you they can definitely hear you okay and always remember guys okay always remember okay to check your your volume here okay the volume okay so in here okay so whatever the uh, the sources that you are adding here it will show up in here okay so it will show up in here so let's just say you want to add a video okay so the next uh, thing you do is media source okay if you want to add a video on your live stream so you should click uh, that one okay so let's just say i want to add this one okay okay so let's just say i want to add that one okay so if you want this video to be played many times again and again and again and again okay so you should loop it okay so loop means uh, repeating the video again and again and again and again okay so then you're going to click okay so then so this is this is the video okay so if i want that one to be viewed or repeated many times and again and again and of course you can always adjust this one many times as much as you want okay so it's up to you okay so you can you can adjust how how big it is if you want so let's just say we have a video on this live stream okay so let's just say we have a video on this live stream so uh, you're going to see media source right media source okay so uh, if you don't want the music of the v uh, the media source will be heard by your viewers you can close this one so when you close that one they cannot hear anything 
of the sound of your video okay so you should always check in here guys okay but if you want the sound of your of your uh, media source to be here then you can do it like that and then if you don't want to be here your mic then you can close your mic so whatever you want okay you just check this one out okay okay so that's how you're going to add it okay mm -hmm.